and we're back to learning game and this time I'm going to show the basics of the workspace. Just a general introduction, if it's wholly new to GIMP, this is what I like to use as a layout and it is the default layout. You can see all of these tabs right here, toolbox on the right hand side we've got more tabs, for example for the brushes, the history, and you will find this button right here, configure this tab, even here at the bottom I've got the layers tab open, and if I click on configure I can for example detach it. So the layers tab has now its own window and you can do that to basically everything. Sometimes it's a little bit hard to drag it back. So just click on configure and then add it right here. So now the layers tab is back. Under windows we've got the general boxes for show tab and hide dogs. You want to show the tab and uncheck hide dogs. So if you don't see your tabs at all, check the windows menu right here. And in earlier game versions you've got this mode. So where your toolbox, your tabs and your let's say canvas, they are in different windows. So if that's the case for you, just go to windows and then select a single window mode. I've screwed around with my layout so the single window mode now looks a little bit different. If you want to go back to the default, just go to edit, preferences, find the interface and there's the window management. Click on reset saved window positions to default values and confirm it. All you have to do now is to close GIMP and then restart it. And this should give you the layout that I've had in the beginning. Obviously you'll have to resize your window and reposition it a little bit. But you can see now I've got the toolbox on the left hand side, layers, brushes and stuff on the right hand side and it's a single window mode only. So if you're a total beginner and you've gotten somewhat lost, you may have lost a tab or misclicked somewhere, just go to the preferences and edit interface and then window management and restore it. And then you have the layout that I'm using for all of my tutorials. And these are the basics of using the workspace in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.